Since a nigga won't be in my business, since y'all want to be in my business with the negativity. That's not what I was doing. I was giving y'all some motherfucking life management skills. I'm going to come out with a life management program. Teach you how to mind your motherfucking business. You're going to be able to manage your life so fucking great. You heard me? You have to do things to keep your relationship interesting. You heard me? I might say baked blonde hair, red hair, blue hair, green hair. Look how you look, baby. You look good. Anyway, this, you know, you, you keep doing the same shit. It, it repetitive, man. That shit get boring to me. I can't do the same shit every day. So, you know, you got to do shit to spice shit up, man. Y'all go get couples massages, go see a movie, go out to eat, you know, have date night once a week. You know what I'm saying? Have fuck night, you know, two, three times a day. I mean, you know. Oh, shit. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I ain't mean to say that, forgive me. <laughs> but yeah, all that, all well. Oh, baby. I love you, baby. I love you too. I love you just the way you are, baby. I love you just the way you are. I know. She was with me when I was fat. Yeah. You was with me when I was, a, I was, I was. A, a fat slob. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you got it together. Yeah, I got it together, dog. I was suffering from depression, bro. I had a lot of internal issues I was battling with, you know. But you know, depression is a real thing, you know. It come at the, the when you least expect. Hey, PB, talk about man. You got all this money. You rich? Shut the fuck up, bitch. Money means nothing to me. When you're a great person, when you're a great person, you expect greatness from others. When you don't get that, that shit affects you. It puts you in a shell, make me like fuck people. I can't be like that though. Because the world needs me. People suffer from depression. It's a real thing. Say, look, a lot of people gonna look at this fucked up. I love Colin Kaepernick. That's my brother. I love his beautiful queen, Nessa. I love these people with all my heart. He should have never took a knee. Should have never took a knee. We bowed for no man under the stars, but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He should have stood palms up and recited the fight that how like Mahmoud Abdul Raouf, Chris Jackson, yeah, him played for Denver, yeah. Alhamdulillah, we bow for no man under the stars, but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But God, one umrah. That's it. That's it. Palms up. Yes, sir. All will.